to a story of triumph of adversity now. And the second top student in KCSC was Alan Wasonga Udoma, who's also here from Agoro Sare School in Oyugis, that's in Oma Bay, who scored a plane with 87.173 points. The 18-year-old who lives in a bed sitter in Kibra with his family recalls studying in the toilet at night during the nine months that he spent at home so that his family could get some sleep with the lights off. The end result is clear for all to see, and here now is a story of resilience as told by Wahiga Moura. Good news can sometimes be overwhelming. So much so that all you can do is fall to your knees and weep for joy. Her name is Rose Wasonga, and a few minutes ago, her son's name was mentioned favorably on national TV. The second one, it's again from a non-entity called Agoro Sare High School, somewhere, somewhere. The name is Wasonga Alan Udoma. The day had begun like any other for this family of six who live in a bedsitter in the Kibra slums. Until the announcement was made, thrusting their 18-year-old into instant nationwide fame. I had my name at number two. Then now all hell broke loose. I rose up, banged the door went and at the balcony and I shouted. Alan's humble background meant that a scholarship is what enabled him to pursue his studies. And he now joins the league of 893 other students who scored plain A's countrywide in the midst of a pandemic. But he faced a greater disadvantage. The challenge of access to online learning proved difficult for the time that he spent at home. Lakini nilijaribu siku ya kwanza Naangalia, naona hizi, naona hiyo video, naona mwalimu wa kemia anafunza, lakini sasa sauti ya hiko. Zile zenye, zina, zile zenye na, unapata hata hiko na scratches, zile zenye napata pia, unapata ni zile topic za mbele. But now, in the end, when, when, we go to, when we went to school for that second term, I always kept that in my mind that for the seven months, that you didn't read, there were some students who, who were reading. Whenever I felt like sleeping and not just sleeping for the normal hours, then it, it came to my mind, some people have read for seven months, you didn't read. Do you think you'll get the same grade if you sleep also? He is part of a generation that not only faced a pandemic during their exam year, but also had to deal with a teacher strike in 2015, months before their KCPE exams. This had an adverse effect on Alan's KCPE result, and consequently, he failed to qualify for the first choice of schools on his list. I live in Fanya KCPE, and as a sema, we were somehow disappointed, of which at a user results, I could accept. Alikata his results. Mana ni mtoto mwenye. Ata primary alikuwa hivo top. Ala analitaka maseno ama maranda. Hakupata. Alitua kwa shule hakutaka. Alan's mother is not shy about her son's determination when it came to achieving his full academic potential. And she recalls his punishing study rituals during the time that he spent at home as a result of the countrywide lockdown. Sasa ni kamuambia Alan. Hii nyumba, hii stima inafanya silali. Please somanga mchana. Haka nina mchana, kelele hapa area ina nistatiza ni kisoma. So usiku ndiyo, nimezo ya kusoma. Nika muambe zima hiyota. So, eh, nilishtuka nikienda washroom. Nakuta kijana nasoma, mejifungia kwacho. Kamuleza, nikubisha nasikia mutu wako kwa washroom. Kamuleza, nani ni halani? Unafanya nini? Kufungua na pata anakona kitabu. The effort has clearly paid off. And as his family celebrates his results, Alan has already turned his attention to university, where he hopes to pursue a medical and surgery course at a local institution. I mainly have chosen a, a local university in Kenya because I can study here, do that and come and help my people. I don't want my knowledge and skills to go and help people abroad while my natives are suffering. The prayerful family might soon have two doctors in this house, with Alan's elder sister already pursuing medicine at Kenyatta University. It is said that true champions are made when no one is watching. And indeed, few were paying attention as Alan struggled through his KCP exams, struggled to get into a good secondary school, struggled through the challenges of online learning and the COVID-19 pandemic. But now, 
the whole country is celebrating his KCSE results. A true story of the power of triumph of the human spirit. I'm Waihiga Mwaura in Kibra, Nairobi County.